Okay, so I had installed the cruise control switch and everything is in place except uh, it doesn't work. So let's see about that. Okay, like so. Then we go to engine. Uh, this is also the place where you enable the controller. Look for the G in the in that string. Uh, you can do it by using that login procedure. But uh, we have already it enabled, so we are going to go to measuring blocks. And let, let's select number 6, which is for the CCS, okay, so it displays uh, binary values there, and that's the speed of the car. Uh, let's start looking what, what uh, those uh, things do. So the first two are for the cruise control. You turn it off. And those values uh, revert to zero. Okay, let's put it back on. Like so. And then I'm going to press the deceleration button here. Next to that one is the acceleration switch, so that works too. Uh, then possible reasons are the brake pedal, so I'm going to just gently press the brake. Okay, the lights went on. Now I'm pressing it more. The Another bit came on, so that works. Uh, next thing to do is to test the clutch. So I'm pressing the clutch lever, but uh, nothing happens. So there's my fault with this car. It, uh, the clutch thinks uh, it's uh, pressed continuously so it doesn't work. Okay. Let's go here. Take the that off. It, it the switch comes off by rotating it. And like so. Okay, let's Put it back on, like so. And now I'm going to use it manually with my hand. Yeah, it works. Let's examine the switch. Okay, I don't know if you can see it on the camera. But the tip is worn and probably, yeah, there's a little pot right there also, so there's the problem. Uh, for the first bit, I don't know what that is. But uh, you can see it on the Rostec website. They have this uh, table, but uh, it didn't quite uh, quite match what I have on screen. So I had to look into the values myself. Okay.